Hello and welcome back to Gold Rush the Game. I'm going to do something very impulsive right now. Something that I shouldn't do whatsoever. You know, fuck it, might as well. I'm going into town and I'm buying the. Um, front loader, I think it's called. Yeah, ignore the tailgate, it's fucking. that is down. I believe it's the front loader. Fuck it, it's turned brights on. You know, because another seven grand's gonna disappear from the account soon. We've got 11, almost 12 ounces of gold. So that's sweet as a fucking nut. Oh, we're gonna wait for the uh, town to load in. There we go. Somebody wants to work for me. Good for them. I figured the uh, uh, large excavator isn't getting me enough gold. Well, I don't believe it is anyway. Can't move it out, moving vehicle, blah blah, but it's a video game, get over it. So, what I'm gonna do is on impulse, I'm buy this front end loader. seven grand. I'm gonna scoop up the pay dirt with that. Well, at least that's my hey, that's what I'm gonna try and do. No, that one needs to go to. Oh, yeah. I've also got um, oh, the River Town. I've actually got this stuff at River Town as well. I've actually uh, lent that out. I bought that because I thought I could maybe put it on this one and put it on the, the second one on this uh, trommel on the um, wash plant. I was wrong. That has been delivered there. So at some point we're going to make get another um, another wash plant over there, at River Town. You know, no, we don't need it. Base out west wasted 22 grand, which which was a mistake. I wasted did waste 22 grand. I can't sell stuff back to the uh, thingy, so that stuck over there with the small digger. But I've also sent my uh, one of my workers over there, so so he's uh, working that claim. And oh yeah. Barely doing any speed there at all, and a flicking arse end around. Wow. Yep, 12 ounces of gold in the bank now. Whoa, sliding around there like in nobody's business. So that's. about 14 grand there in gold that's two days worth of gold so that's not so bad oh yeah don't waste gas or the battery guess I have to go around the other side
present differential. Uh. Oh, clear away. Gonna take some getting used to driving this thing. Oh, this is weird. Let's control the blade with the, um, yeah, with these ones. Oh, fuck me backwards. How is this big bulky fucking bit of machinery stuck on a tiny bit of fucking dirt? I mean, really? Really, it's gonna get stuck on that little bit of fucking dirt? Fucking serious, this thing is stuck on that little bit of dirt under its front fucking wheel. That's as high as the blade will go. Suck at using this. But we turn this fucking Jenny on. That's how much gold I've put into it so far. There's very gold in running to the bottom of it. And there's a bit of gold in there. Not been very successful so far with this thing. Would have planned all the um, All this now.
Seriously? The arms don't go further than that. Oh right, that's the differential. So apparently the arms are go further than that and that means I'm stuck. What's the point in this thing then? Because this is a thing you use to load. I'm not, I'm just getting, I ain't gonna fucking keep resetting this country thing every time I want to do something. That's ridiculous. This thing shouldn't have a problem loading all into that. Because that's what this is actually prompt made me for. If you watch the you know, Go Rush TV show, you'll see this thing loading ore into that wash button, into a wash one. <sighs> one minute. I'm done. Okay, I, I admit you, I'm done. I'm going to rise up. No. Stop. Try not to not to be too dumb. Uh, but now we're stuck. What is this big fucking bulky machine stuck on? That's better. Now I'm getting angry at this piece. I'm probably gonna crash a hundred fucking thousand times, but you know, we'll, we'll fucking we'll crash it together. Oh, um, yeah. It's not very maneuverable with that fucking boon all the way up there. With a bucket. I need to move that out of the fucking way some more. I'll probably jump it big excavator and uh, you know, shove it off somewhere. Now I'm getting the hang of this thing. Down. Seriously, I'm stuck on the fucking machine. That's better. Now, the new workers are supposedly working on this. Pretty sure them front fucking out that front ends on the ground. 
fail, epic failure, yet again, reset big excavator, which is incompetence here, strikes again. I'm glad I'm finally getting the hang of that uh, digger, not digger, the frontline loader. So I've been you know, completely cocked up the first bit of it. I want to get that wash plant out of the way. Now, I suppose I should use the truck, you know, because that would be the logical thing. Point being logical when I've got a fucking big excavator here. I can push the sun bitch out of the way. Hopefully make some big fucking cat oh yeah. Is the water even fucking turned on? I just want to get as much dirt in this plant as I can. So that means moving this stupid fucking old um, bit of machinery out of fucking way with a bit of force. And so be it. That's it. No, I don't give two fucks about this. Push that off the hill, huh? How's that stuck on front ended? You know, cheaty cheaty. Reset that. Turn the lights off, turn the engine off. Do that. And then get out. You know, because the new guy's supposed to be working on that. That's out of the way. Let's get back in this thing. Get some fucking work done. Yeah, this is definitely a lot faster than the other machinery I've got, so...
so I'll just definitely put this so so be careful when you're using this thing. Yeah, this is more spare. Okay, it's still getting more spare and yellow. There is one thing this game could use, though, is that, you know, the NPCs, they actually, you know, actually there. It's been definitely been a learning curve this episode. Learn how to handle this beast. Seriously, that tiny bit of fucking dirt is going to block me. Really, that little bit of dirt in front, on, underneath that tire is blocking this big fucking machinery. Anyone else calling bullshit? big fucking machine. A tiny bit of fucking dirt. Jesus fucking Christ. And some motherfucker wept. Don't know that comes name but apparently he wept. Oh he might have been I don't know, some cop wept or something. Some kind of bullshit saying. Oh, you might really go on. Some fake person go, Jesus. You know about some dude wrote about him in a book. You know, a bit like Harry Potter. No, he ain't real. And also a bit like the Twilight Saga. Not bad movie. You know, it's 
about vampires, it's not fucking real. Also, if you are a religious fanatic, no offence, but you believe in a zombie. Supposedly, the dude came back to life after he died. Reanimation. That makes him a fucking zombie. You know, ladies and gentlemen, having uh, discussed the uh, bullshit religion, no, for no reason. Having played Gold Rush. Oh, yeah, because I'm in America, that's why. This is Gold Rush. Yeah. No. Thank fuck we sent all the fucking fanatical fucking religious people to over there. So we English people don't have to put up with that bullshit. So yeah, if you don't mind leaving a like on this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already subscribed, comment in the comment section, share the video, and I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.